In this video, I will be demonstrating the importance of the zirconium alloy used as fuel cladding in the nuclear reactors. According to an article written by the president of the National Academy of Engineering in 2000, nuclear power was an achievement that helped define 20th century technology, and the zirconium material helped make this achievement possible. But first, exactly how important was the development of nuclear power? Near the end of World War II, scientists began to research ways to gain useful energy from nuclear reactions for the benefit of society, as opposed to the destructive force of the atomic weapons used at the war's end. This was achieved in 1953 with the making of the first prototype nuclear reactor used in the construction of nuclear-powered submarines the following year. Under the leadership of President Eisenhower and his Atoms for Peace program, atomic power was later commercialized in the private sector. The city of Shippingport, Pennsylvania was the world's first location to utilize the power of nuclear energy for the generation of electricity. How were these reactors constructed and what role does zirconium play in their functions? Depicted here is the basic schematic of a pressurized water reactor, or PWR, that is used in both submarines and power plants. Zirconium alloys are used within the main reactor vessel in order to contain the uranium pellets used for powering the fission reaction. Zirconium was chosen for their very specific properties that are unrivaled by any other material. What are these properties and how did material science and engineering enable engineers to choose zirconium as an appropriate metal cladding? The purpose of material science and engineering is to optimize the properties and materials by altering their structure, modeling, and processing. By doing this, scientists have developed a zirconium alloy that is very resistant to corrosion and extreme temperatures. These properties enable the material to not deform within the immense heat of the reactor core, and they allow it to function in the surrounding water without the risk of chemically decomposing. Besides these intrinsic material properties, zirconium is also relatively easy to manufacture, which is advantageous from a business perspective. Additionally, the material absorbs very few of the neutrons produced in the nuclear fission reaction, enabling the reaction itself to continue. It is safe to say that without zirconium, nuclear power would not exist and its numerous benefits in both the military and private sector would not be recognized. 